to another episode on a Solent Warrior with local marks. For some reason, the camera's not great. We're not getting a great camera. But um, we are down here. We are going to cook up some lobsters. We've got some monkfish, we've got some lobsters. And I don't know if you can see down here, we have got what will be a jet stove shortly. So I'm going to make a jet stove out of a log and we're going to do a bit of cooking. So at the moment, we're just going to start getting the uh, kindling all cut up and uh, I hope you enjoy it. Probably apologise to uh, Mrs. Silent Warrior because I've got all of the kitchen <laughs> and our best knife down here. Oh. <laughs> I'm sure she'll understand. It's all for the good of mankind. Thank you, John. How you doing? tiny bits of kindling that'll probably do us for a minute I'll get this a couple off of here right ladies and gentlemen Dave's just chopping up some kindling for the rod uh, Stephen how you doing you right Gunner's there the legend got a one how you doing uh, that's just your Ben the legend is there right guys I've got to put the rods quite a far away oh bad I mean, I reckon if you move them, the wind will blow right through and keep that bloke alight. I need it to go up the funnel. Oh. So, yeah, the hole there, I need it to go up like oh. that. So otherwise, it'll, um, it'll just burn the log out sideways. Oh, right. Yeah. Oh, of course. It's going. Brilliant, though. <laughs> it's going. All I'm doing is just feeding this with tiny little bits of kindling until the log is taken in the middle. Once it's taken properly, it'll go for hours. You see that jet coming out of the top now, look. Once this is going, I'll be able to get a few rods out. 
for the minute. Once it's taken, you won't need to touch this anymore. That is a little bit of southwesterly wind. We've got a hole drilled at the bottom there, and it's just funneling air beautifully inside that, and it'll burn from inside out. taken now get these last little bits in and I might need to touch it again I don't even know if I'm going to get any rods out I think I'm just going to do cooking oh, all night mate, mate. that looks whiskey, mate. That, <laughs> that is nice Two gunner three going on here tonight. Have we got some more gunners? Log gunning, stove. We've got a hole drilled down there. You see there's a fire in the middle of the log there. There's a hole at the top here. And that's boiling some uh, fresh seawater. Ready for a beautiful lobster to go into. And if we've got enough fuel towards the end, I have got a bag of logs here. We'll cook up some monkfish as well. I've got some monkfish today. So we can cook him up and cook a couple of lobsters. Beautiful. This is where we're just getting the rods out. First chucks. What baits you got on there, mate? Sorry, mate. What baits you got Brilliant on? Squid. Bluey and squid. Bluey and squid tonight. Looking for a ray? Yeah. Nice. Hopefully. There's some rag ground down here, mate, if you want to grab some of that. Sorry, mate. These bad boys are ready to go in. Once we're boiling. It's got some big claws on this. He's a big old boy, this one. This is a female. See how she's tucking up much broader across the back. You see the back's broader it's where they carry their eggs. Shouldn't be too long. Right, so we're up to the rolling boil now. What you want is a massive rolling boil and then just pop them in. There's this batch already. And then once that's back up to the once that's back up to the rolling boil, then you can boil it for another two minutes and that'll be done. We've got this on the go at the moment. We're gonna get a frying pan on that once the coals have gone down a bit. And then we're going to cook up some monkfish on that one. Right. We have been boiling away. We've brought it back to a rolling boil. 
Oscar Maria. I've got 30 seconds. Once it gets back to a rolling boil, two minutes. And then them lobsters will be done. And then we've got this over here ready for the frying pan. We're going to take these off. I'll dump the seawater out and I'm going to put cold water into it and cool them down. Right. They're cooked. We're just melting a bit of butter in here. And then these are going to get devoured. Right, here we go. We're just going to crack the lobsters open. <laughs> I'm following your lead. You just gotta give it a good whack. Mm. So if you can get it, so it's just. Is a nice lollipop. Is that what they call it? Yeah. Just got to sort of whack it all the way around. Do this bit, yeah. Just as the claws meet, you get like a little, little case. Right. It? Dip it in your butter. Oh, oh, I knew it. Yeah. Bit. What this bit? Yeah. Perfectly cooked. Pretty special, huh? Perfectly cooked, Dave. Amazing. Yeah. Delicious. Oh. Wow. Right, we're going to get into this. Guys. <laughs> we're going to get into this. And then once we've started cooking up the uh, monkfish, like always, we'll bring you back. We have now got the frying pan up on here. Down here, we have a whole monkfish that are prepared into little slices. We've got salt, bread rolls, mayonnaise, hot paprika, lemon, and pepper. And we're gonna make a proper posh fish finger sandwich. Are you into a fish? <laughs> oh. Right, we have got monkfish cooking up in a bit of oil. The stove's going mental. Bit of oil and a bit of butter. And in a minute, we're going to make some super fish finger sandwiches. I'll move around Dave while you're doing it. Okay. That William is your fish finger sandwich. Mate, brilliant. Thank you. Mm. 
Is it good? Mmm. <laughs> Blimey, Dave, you're like a chef. That's good food. Open your bun up. Thank you. That's proper chow. Um, All right? Yeah, that's it. But what I would also do if I was you. Still recorded. Just have a little dip in that as well. Mm. Oh, mate, that makes all the difference. serious food. Is that dipping good? It's really good. <laughs> it's nice, isn't it, that dip? Yeah. Mm. Now, you can do all of this yeah you know people think you can't cook your lobster because you haven't got a boat and you, you know them lobster are from the fish market and this monkfish is from the fish market all together it's about 50 quid wow but between two of you and a night on a beach having a cook up mm. what's 50 quid beautiful shot there mm. Mate, you're a legend.